Good afternoon, everybody. I am here to play a new game. Well, not really a new game anymore, but this is the Resident Evil 2. I think this is the remake. I hope it is. If it's not, well, sorry. I decided that I would change my style a bit for today, and instead of being a discount moist critical, I'd actually go for the, I don't know, the Tim Pool look, or skier, or whatever the heck you want to call me. I don't really know anything about this game. Maybe I should start with Resident Evil 1, but uh, you know what? We're just going to start here with this. Let, anything to do here? Yeah, you know, th this is something you just figure out. We're going to do the Leon assisted. What do they think I am? Oh, and like I'm not using a controller. Come on, I'm, in, I'm a guy who's got to be in control every second. Standard, hardcore, uh, uh ooh, ha, ha, ha. Yeah, Let, let's not do hardcore. We'll just do standard. We're a standard kind of guy. We don't got these crazy standards, baby. Now loading. Okay. What do we got? So I've been familiar with some of the Resident Evil games. I've really only done the new ones, though. Is that a Garloid? Oh my gosh, that's a hamburger. Yeah, this is the remaster. <laughs> I think this might be kind of quiet. Can I? Nope, I can't. This guy's eating on the road. That is a downpour. <laughs> Woman. <laughs> Hey. Don't go off the road. Oh. It's gonna be a zombie or something. Ah, I'm gonna step into frame. Oh, no. You know what? She's probably all right. Wasn't that bad. Just, you know, it's like kind of getting punched real hard. Like, yeah, it's going to hurt, but. Yeah, she's all right. See? Oh, she's okay, see? Don't worry about it. She's alright. You're good, dude. Say, oh, sorry, sorry about that, miss. RPD. Radical. I I can't think of any word that's not dirty for P. Ms. Oil, my favorite company. Oh, look at those gas prices. <laughs> dude, scary. Oh, those are scary good. Oh, we are funny today. What do we got? Yeah, look at my hair. I'm a I'm I'm a man. Using the diesel? That's weird. Uh oh. Do we got some robbers? Somebody spilled their grape juice all over the floor. This is where I start off. Whoa. Look around. Wee. I guess I stopped pumping. Okay. Oh, man. Those gas prices. Dude, I just. Look how good those gas prices are. What happens if I just go this way? Here we go. I wonder, how far is it going to let me go before... Oh. Nothing out here. <laughs> Nothing out here? Well, how do you know? You got to go further down, and maybe you might find something cool. 
All right. Diesel at dollar oh two. Holy cannoli. All right, what do we got here? What do we got? We got a phone booth? What era is this? Okay. Probably supposed to take place in the 90s or something. I've had a guess. Dingo Red Cigarettes. Yeah, I got cigarette ads. You don't see those too often. At least not in my area. All right, let's go inside. Hamburgers. All right. Why are the lights off if they're open? Hello? That is not a good business strategy. Oh, I got to turn up my volume. Why was there a flashlight? Something's not right. Gee, what was your first clue, brother? That? No, no, that's just grape juice. That was... I'm turning things up real quick because it is very quiet. Oh, geez, are you serious? Okay, well, hopefully it's loud enough for you guys. I'm a little guy just looking at the beer. You all right? Now I see it. You all right, sir? Are you okay? Don't move. I'll be back for you. You're you're right, man. Are are you good? Are you good? It only looks like you got your freaking head ripped into. Did the door close? Okay. What are we what are we hearing over here? I'm sure there is nothing strange beyond this door. Ow. These people got strong jaw strength, dude. You dead? You are not dead. You dead now? Well, glad I had a gun on me. God bless America. Any ammo in here? The, the cop probably had some ammo on. Can I, like, punch people with... What do we got here? A key! Oh, I'm sure I won't need that later. Oh, hello, baby. Ooh. Hubbada, hubbada, hubbada. Anyway. Ooh, Zaza. Ah. All right, what do we got? Anybody? Huh? huh? What the? He's back up. You know what? I think this is a... Get the hell out of it. You need to use an item. This. Use. Who would have guessed that the key would unlock the door? Oh, he is... Hello. What the? Let's get out of here. I don't think we have enough ammo to tackle all... Yeah! Run, 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 run. Run. You're Leon, right? Ooh. See, now, that's a problem right there. In the cutscene, it only takes one shot to kill. I shot that guy like four times in the freaking head and didn't work. Does she have a gun, too? Okay. Hey, mister. Hey. Watch out for those zombies. Oh, baby. Look at that. Mm, now, forward. Forward. You know, it's always strange that there's nobody here until... Well, I guess I made a little bit of sound, but boy. I don't know, maybe zombies? Nice to meet you, Claire. Wow. No. I should call you an E-Claire because you're so sweet. You. Yeah, that was terrible. I'm sorry. Neither do I. Home of Umbrella. 
Oh, uh, okay, okay. Uh-huh. All right, all right, you gotta adjust yourself. Are we in a flying car? No, we are on the ground. Awesome. <laughs> By these Japanese guys. Don't forget Jazz Fry. We're going downtown, baby. Yeah, I'm excited to see what this is. I really don't know anything about the original Resident Evils. I've just seen a little bit and maybe memes or whatever, you know, pretty much just in memes. I know that Raccoon City was like infested with zombies. Uh, and Umbrella has something to do with it. We're going to see what, though, in case somebody doesn't know anything about it. I don't want to spoil it for them. Very interesting. Resident Evil 2. RE2. Or Biohazard, as they call it in Japan. Attention all citizens. Due to the citywide outbreak, you are advised to take shelter at the Raccoon City Police Station. Where they have guns. It has to be. Yeah, I mean, there'll probably be a few hobos or something. I mean, they already made people think they're a zombie anyway. I don't know. Terrible, but... Well, it looks like we got a little bit of a block. Like we're walking from here. <laughs> Hope you don't mind hoofing it. <gasps> oh! So, how do they know? Bonk! Bonk! Hey, it's our friend from earlier! That's right, back up, boy! Uh oh. Oh, he dead. Oof. At least he got the zombies off us. Sheriff County. Ah, uh, yes. I love Sheriff County. That is my jurisdiction. Sheriff County. Claire, Baba Bowie. Okay. Oh, she is not okay. Oh, man. Ow. Not a big of an oil or explosion as I thought it would be from freaking oil tanker like that. And I will... Oh my goodness gracious. I do not have enough ammo to take... Take this on. Well, let's just go this way. Maybe there's a station this way. Ah. Yeah, I only have five bullets. Holy crap. What's up, dude? How are you? Can I, like, get over cars? No? Oh, crap. Okay, down there. An alley. Good, let's go down there. That's probably safe. Good thing these zombies are pretty stupid. Shit. It's everybody. They've all turned. Bro, they're getting turned, dog. Sorry, that was terrible. I'm still a zoomer, alright? I have the right to say it. RPD. Hello. Okay. Hi there. Hello, okay. Woo. We made it. 
Well, I hope Claire can get in now. Hope you brought a body bag. What if I just fired off all my rounds now for no reason? That'd be hilarious, I think. Collectible, collectible, find the collectibles. And nothing. Let's check out inside, baby. What do we got? We. All right. Um. Keep out. All right. Uh. Uh huh. Is anybody here? Uh huh. I'm sure this is safe. Oh, you know when there's yellow, you gotta do it with a fellow. Wait a sec. Uh, uh huh. Oh, what are all these goofy? Man, I always really like the goofy puzzles that they have in Resident Evil. Like you can't take it too seriously, just because it's like, like what even? You could probably guess what this is if I had to guess. I mean, there's only so many combinations you can do. Alright, we were going to put on the... I want to say these are snakes. I mean, shrimps, but they look... They're snakes. They're snakes. I want to say they're shrimps, though. That'd be cool if they were shrimp. Nope. <gasps> Ammo! Oh, looks just like it does in a... No? How about there? Oh, we got a full mag. Oh, nice. Nice. We are very happy right now, dude. Now, where are we headed? Where are we headed? Was there anywhere else? I was maybe unlocked? Maybe I'm supposed to go where it said to keep out. So I can't go there. I can't go there yet. Oh, there's a button. wonder what this button does. <laughs> or, well, it's not a button, but... Dude, it says keep out. Maybe you shouldn't go in here. It, it probably says keep out for a reason. But we are going to not listen to that because we are our own man, baby. We don't listen to you if you want to keep yourself okay. We need a fuse. Good thing we got this flashlight. Hopefully it doesn't run out of batteries. Yeah, self... Uh, Motivation? Self-motivation. Well, what can I do with this, actually? Can I... Oh, I have to hold a... Uh, come on! Uh... Ah! Woo! Hope that doesn't bite me in the butt later. Hydrant. I can't hydrate there. Wow. Going in the ladies' bathroom. Wait, who am I again? Am I Leon? I think I'm Leon. Alright, which one of these is going to have a ghoul inside? First aid spray. I thought that was just a can of hairspray. Why would that be in the woman's bathroom? A little weird. Well, nobody yet. They probably aren't going to spawn. Okay. Probably won't spawn till later, if I had to guess. Just an idea, though. I could be wrong. This is pretty cool looking so far, though. Ooh. Jesus. Well, there are three people right here. Hello? I'll get you out. Please. Come here, help me. I got you. 
pole. How is <laughs> How is he alive? All right, what did he have? Lighter? Notebook. Ooh. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh. What are these weird like convoluted inventions who built these things you have to put three medallions into the statue and then the statue like moves and opens up a staircase and then from the staircase you can get out like what what is this who built this, this is like some medieval castle kind of secret passageway kind of crap what is this okay so one of them is on a lion statue one of them is on a unicorn statue one of them is a statue of a lady oh hey we look at that there are the combinations. So we saw one of those statues in the main hall. Very cool. Go, 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 run, 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 run. Ah! Kick him, kick him, kick him! Slamming on him. Oh, yeah, that's right. Oof. Oh, you look a little messed up, man. Marvin Brown. Leon Kennedy. There was another officer I had could Man, that guy's a little messed up. Oof. Well, I'm glad to be out of there. That was terrible. But honestly, all you need to know is that this place will eat you alive if you aren't careful. Yeah, well, I was supposed to start last week, and I got a call to stay away. I wish I'd come here sooner. Are you sure about that? <laughs> okay, Lieutenant. I'm ready. Hopefully you'll be able to find a way out of this station. That officer you met earlier, Elliot. He thought this secret passageway might be a trick to Maybe yeah, don't be holding that with your blood soaked finger. <laughs> we can get you to a hospital. No, no, I am not retaliating for you. Lieutenant, I'm not just gonna leave you here. I'm giving you an order, rookie. You save yourself first. I'd come with you, but I just lay you down. I wonder if I get more armor now because I have that stuff on. Stop. And don't make my mistake. If you see one of those things, uniform or not, do not hesitate. You smash them. Smash them to bits. Take it out. Then you run. Got it? Yes, sir. Ooh, a combat knife. Oh, oh, oh boy. Where's down with use? Oh, that sucks. Well, hopefully I can get a few more at least. Alright, so... How is my health doing? Can I see it? Caution. Yeah, we're good enough for now. We are good enough for now. Though we know this uh, this combination, so... Our inventory. Boom. Lion, leaf, bird. Let's see. Lion. Leaf. Bird. We got the lion medallion, baby. Ooh. Elliot was right. Yeah. 
Yeah. The passage isn't open yet. So now what can I do? What do I have on me? Wait, I have a key. Storage room key. Oh, I don't need this anymore. I can probably get rid of it. Uh, I don't know where. You know what, guys? I'm taking off the beanie. We are getting rid of the Tim Pool look. Look, we got our slicked back hair, baby. Oh, we are looking handsome. Well, handsome's a relative term. What do we got? Let's blow that up. No. Let's... <laughs> terrible. Terrible, Dante. You're terrible. So, where to go next? Oh, I can use a knife for this. There we go. It's all about progression. This is not how I imagined my first day. Got that herb. Do we only got four inventory slots? This sucks. Information. Yeah, I'd like some information on how to kill myself. This is terrible. All right, what do we got here? That weird... You okay there, officer? There's a lot more muscle in that face than I thought there was. Yeah, there's another zombie around, dude. Are you surprised? What? Why? What? What am I going to use on the window? It's like that Outlast jump scare with the dude hanging on the... Bruh, I predicted it, and even then it still caught me. <laughs> okay. What do we got? Why do I still have the gas station key, though? Can I get rid of this? I could probably get rid of this. That's a big old scratch. Why do I need an item for this? What... Okay. Let's just zoom around. Well, he's not strong enough to break the glass. Uh, he is strong enough to break the glass. Very cool. How about this lady? Oh, come on now. That's BS, dude. That's right, lady. Oh, you are gone. You are dead and buried, baby. I already used that much of the knife? Oh, jeez. Boy, the... <sighs> knives these days, man. They don't build them like they used to. Maybe I gotta kind of use it a little more sparingly. Fine. There we go. Oh, I can hold a bunch of ammo in one. Very cool. Ooh. Record of events. We're turning the station to a temporary shelter due to massive sudden outbreak. All personnel, police personnel have instructed to make the safety of citizens their top priorities. We try to accommodate as many of them as possible. September 25th, one of the refugees attacked us in the middle of the night, resulting in the death of one officer and injuring three others. The person we yeah, then question was quickly restrained. We believe there was simply a case of someone snapping under intense stress. A mob attacked the station today, resulting in a number of casualties. A few survivors were able to make it safely behind the emergency shutters, but surrounded as we were, it'll be hard for any of us to escape this place. We're not sure we can fix any of our comm equipment, so we remain cut off from the outside world. So number 27, there was another clash on the west side of the station around 1 p.m. 12 people died. There's only handful of survivors left. Everything is falling just right here. David Ford. Well, I'm sorry, Mr. Ford. Okay, how do I get out? Thank you. Ooh, what do we got here? Map? Map. Let's go. Okay, red means I haven't... Yeah, I'm searching. Huh? Okay. Well, at least eventually I'll know this map like the back of my hand. 
We right there, fella. That fella is not all right. Hey there, pal. I have seen your exact model before. What is this? How do I check my... Look at that. It loses itself so quickly. Like, what's the point of even having this darn knife? Oh, man. Dude, I don't even want to walk up to any people. Uses of gunpowder. Handgun ammo. Gunpowder times two. Oh, it's a show I can make. Mag ammo. What's that? There's not a lot of ammo left around the stations so to make use of gunpowder. Different guns work or different ammo so I tend to find. Very cool. Why would they're just why would that be lying around there? Hello there, buddy. Ooh, we got a safe. What's the combination? I don't wanna Give you any ideas? Hello? Can I look at this, please? Thank you. Operation report. Just me and three others. No weapons, no ammo, and too many skirmishes that us mentally and physically. We're not going to make it. Officer Phillips says we escaped through the sewers. Apparently, there's a secret tunnel under this. <laughs> Left over for the museum days. Yeah, museums just have secret tunnels under their areas. I brushed off her idea before, but now it's not sitting all that bad. Yeah, you know, really. Yeah, there's no proof there's any tunnel in the sewers that are infested with zombies. I don't want to sit here and no one to die. It's a long shot. I'm going to find out something I can about that tunnel. Elliot. Oh, that was the guy. That was the guy. Very cool. Rookie's first assignment. Kennedy. We're putting on a very special case. Is to unlock your desk. The get the the key to your success is in the first is in the initials of our first names. L S K. Input the letters in order of our desks. There are two locks, one on each side of your desk. Make sure you get them both. The initials of our first names. There are two locks, one on each side of your desk. Make sure you get them both. Remember your fellow officer's names we figured out that much uh, outright. Good luck, Leon. By the way, I might take a little work to Scott to give you a straight answer. Scott. Huh. Okay. Scrawled in the corner between drops of blood. Be glad you're not here, rookie. <laughs> Initials of our first names. Scott may not give you straight answers. So maybe there's like some goofy with Scott. All right. Marvin. M. R. As long as I don't get too close to them. M. R. S. Maybe. N E D. Sorry, pal. Very good. H I J K L M N O P N E D. Yay! All right. So that was probably Scott. S. R M. Very good. Dude, we are just too good at this. S. Don't know your alphabet speed run. S. Where the heck is S? What? Hold up. S. R. M. Maybe it's MRS. M. R. No. MRG. Very. Yep. See, there we go. See, we did it. We did it, baby. <gasps> yeah, baby.
Yeah, baby. Combine. Oh, we got that high capacity mag. Look at that nice Leon S. Kennedy. Oh, 24 in a mag. Ooh, sheesh. Combine. Uh, I don't have anything to combine it with. Well, that was sweet. Well, that was sweet of them. Give me a nice little, uh. Well, that was sweet of them. Give me a nice little welcome present. Wooden boards. Oh, I can board up the windows. Yeah. Oh, baby. Mm-hmm. Oh, very nice. And then now, wait, uh, move, combine. Yeah, yeah. What do we got here? Medical benefits of herbs. Can you stop preaching about weed, man? Come on. <laughs> uh-huh. Green herbs have to be able to hear old basic, and blue are for poisoning. Red are appealing. No benefits or thought so until recently. Rolling that combined herbs together produces buns that heighten the herbs' effects. I'm going to discover that red herbs can play a big role when mixed properly. Uh huh. Yeah, spaghetti. Oh, oh, so red and blue can make you strong. Maybe that's like a permanent health upgrade or something. That might be a good one to do. Hmm. All right, well, I'm sure there's no herbs around here. Oh, we got a save point, finally. All right, well, with that, I think we're going to call it. This is not really like Resident Evil 7 and Village, where I feel like these people are not going down very easily. But then again, I've played those games about, I don't know, I've, I've probably played through the campaign about 15 times or Resident Evil Village, so I can't really speak for that because... It, I know it so well. This I don't know at all. But anyway, this has been very fun. And I want to thank you guys all for tuning in to watch this. And I will see you in the next time. Bye.